Money changes all relationships. When Zaid visits his neighbors now, the traditional feast for a visitor becomes an offering to a wealthy benefactor instead. Unlike many of Arabia's oil millionaires, Zaid believes in sharing his wealth. He told me once, the oil business is like a lottery. I might still be poor and my neighbors might be rich. So we ought to help each other. He's already given away millions. Zaid's host at this feast was one of his poorest neighbors. But now that Zaid has touched his palm with silver, he won't be quite so poor. <laughs> the feast is traditional. Goat's meat, chicken and rice. And when the VIPs are finished, the lesser men move in. It's always the custom in Arabia for the poor to eat at the rich man's table, or rather, off the rich man's floor. When this lot are finished, there'll still be more to come. In descending order of rank, and ascending order of hunger. It's not the most elegant spectacle, and it's not the choicest food, but in a harsh and hungry land, any excuse is welcome for a blowout, especially when it's held for a man with money. The old Arabia pulls at the heart. The world where Zaid was raised, where he always likes to be, around the campfire and the